This work takes time and will require vigilance and resilience and perspective. But I'm confident that just as we have for more than two centuries, we will ultimately prevail. And part of what gives me that confidence is the overwhelming response of the world community to the savagery of these terrorists. Not just revulsion, but a concrete commitment to work together to vanquish these organizations. At the United Nations in September, I called on the international community to come together and eradicate this scourge of violent extremism. And I want to thank all of you from across America and around the world for answering this call. Tomorrow at the State Department, governments and civil society groups from more than 60 countries will focus on the steps that we can take as governments. And I'll also speak about how our nations have to remain relentless in our fight, our counterterrorism efforts against groups that are plotting against our countries. But we are here today because of a very specific challenge, and that's countering violent extremism, something that is not just a matter of military affairs. 